Grow Lights Depot here to unbox a Next Light Veg8. This is one of the three LED grow lights in the Next Light commercial series, the other two being the Next Light Mini and the Next Light Mega. The Next Light Veg8 emits a full white light spectrum and is designed for vegetative growth, whether you're growing starters, leafy greens such as lettuce, veg and cannabis, or growing up clones. Let's check it out. Upon opening the box, we notice that there are some instructions inside looks like there's only one sheet, proper use, cleaning, that sort of thing. The Veg8 is 22 inches by 46 inches by 2.5 inches and it only weighs 10 pounds. It has a wide form factor, so the dimensions of the fixture are nearly identical to its footprint, which means that you get a nice even coverage area under the unit. Notice that there aren't any cooling fans. The unit is passively cooled via the aluminum frame and casing. Overall, there are minimum bells and whistles. The reason why the Veg8 might be more expensive than some other vegging LEDs is because Nextlight focus on high quality diodes and the best driver on the market. The 100 to 277 volt AC auto sensing driver made by Meanwell is encased on the rear of the unit in order to protect it. Two hanging hooks serve as attachment points for adjustable hangers, but these may be removed and the holes can be used for mounting under racks or installing your own hanging system. When purchasing the Veg8, you can choose between a 120 volt and 240 volt cord and plug. The 120 volt version comes with a NEMA 515 plug, and the 240 volt models come with a NEMA 615 plug. Nextlight uses highly efficient Samsung LM561B diodes, which are rated for 100,000 hours at 77 degrees ambient temperature. That's about 15 years on an 18.6 Veg cycle. Note that higher temperatures will decrease the lifespan. There are no secondary lenses on the unit, so without these you get increased efficiency and a wider light spread. The light output of the Veg8 clocks in at around 365 micromoles per second. This is a perfect amount of light given the size and coverage area of the fixture. This fixture does not come with dimming capabilities or spectrum control. The Veg8 emits a PPF of 1.92 micromoles per joule and is one of the most efficient Veg lights on the market. The next light Veg8 only draws 190 watts and will replace an 8 tube T5 fluorescent grow light fixture, which can draw up to 450 watts. So overall, that's 60% less electricity and 60% less heat. Simple math shows that this unit will pay for itself within one year, assuming the bulb changes and extra energy cost with an 8-tube T5 fixture. When ran on 120 volts, the Veg8 draws 1.6 amps, and when ran on 240 volts, it draws 0.8 amps. The Veg8 utilizes a full white light spectrum with near UVA and IR light. The red to blue ratio is about 1 to 1, which is an ideal spectrum for good compact growth and efficient photosynthesis. A higher proportion of blue keeps plants stout while red drives growth. Compare the spectrum with an 8-tube T5 fixture and see the differences. The Veg8 spectrum is more complete, which is more beneficial to plants, compared to the T5 spectrum, which is lacking a lot of red and other colors. Overall, the spectrum has been proven to drive vegetative growth with excellent results. Expect a 4 foot by 2 foot coverage area with this fixture. One Veg8 is perfect for a lot of seedlings, many clones, or a few cannabis plants in the vegetative state. Or you can grow as many heads of lettuce that you can fit under a 2 by 4 area. If you need a large Veg light, or flowering light for that matter, consider the Next Light Mega, which is designed to veg a 7x7 space or flower a 5x5 space. You might also consider the Next Light Mini, which can veg a square area of 3 feet by 3 feet or flower a 2 by 2 foot area. Links for these lights are in the description section below. In most cases, it's recommended that this fixture is used 12 to 24 inches above the plants during veg for the best results. You can hang the light closer, but you'll lose coverage area, but increase the light's intensity. 
One way to use this light is on a low profile vertical racking system for clones or leafy greens. Let's measure the par at 24 inches above the bottom of the surface. Now keep in mind your numbers might be different if you're growing in a smaller area like a 2x4 tent or in an area without reflective surfaces. So right in the middle we're, we're right around 278 ppfd and as I move it closer to me you can see it doesn't drop off that quickly. Uh, it looks like we have a nice even light spread um, across the bottom of the fixture here. All the way in the on the side, looks like it's around 200 plus. And then at the edge of the 2x4 footprint, 180. So overall, fairly even footprint across the bottom of the fixture, no matter where we go. Notice that it's not extremely high in the middle and extremely low in the corners. Okay, now I'm gonna measure the PPFD at 12 inches above the surface. I have the meter right in the middle and it's showing 478 PPFD. I move it to the edge of the two x four footprint, drops off uh, just by a little bit, not too much. Looks like we're at 383 and into the corner of the footprint, which is the lowest points, 240. So not bad for the corner of the footprint. back into the middle you can see how it raises up and I'm just gonna take a peek on the other side just moving it around you can see that the PPFD goes up as I go under the uh, the LED boards a little bit all right, and lastly, I have the Veg8 hung above some plants for a real life application. I'm just gonna put the meter in various places above the plants. So 415, and inside this one, a little bit higher. And then to the one on the left, and then a little bit closer to me. So you can see these plants are placed directly below uh, the Veg8 and they all have fairly even intensity reaching them. So I really like how the boards are spread out on the Veg8 uh, because it provides even intensity throughout the entire 2x4 footprint. Nextlight products are designed and manufactured in the United States with domestic and imported parts and they come with a manufacturer's 5 year warranty. The entire Nextlight commercial series is UL listed for damp and dry locations. They're also DLC premium listed and qualify for energy rebates with most energy providers. The MSRP on the Veg8 is $595, but it's available for $535.50 at LED Grow Lights Depot. View the link in the description or on the product page for a special discount on the Nextlight Veg8 or other LED Grow Lights in the commercial series. If you want to learn more or purchase the Next Light Veg8, check out the link below. And give this video a thumbs up and comment to let us know if you've used this light or what you like about it. If you want more content like this, subscribe here for updates. Hope to see you at LED Grow Lights Depot soon. Peace!